This year at BET, students from the Broad Green School in Liverpool were invited to attend and participate in the Sights and Sounds Treasure Hunt, an activity that gave these 8 to 10 year olds an opportunity to use the Intel powered convertible classmate PC bundled with the Intel Learning Series software to conduct interviews with representatives from the Intel Learning Series Alliance. I work at a company called Lu Luidia and they make um, a product called the eBeam Interactive Whiteboard. It's a very powerful but lower cost alternative to some of the really large um, interactive whiteboards. So our product, you'll see in a minute, is, is just a little piece that's about this big and you use the pen with it and it costs about half as much as the other product. So it, it lets us work in countries where they don't have as much money to spend on, on education products and things like that and it works well for those people. Can you show us it? Yeah, I'd love to. <laughs> so I'm going to give you the pen. Okay. Okay, so just think of that, that's like your mouse. So anything you would do with a mouse, you can do with this pen. Um, so you can start by just kind of clicking on the, the tool palette there. And you can just, just kind of, actually we'll, we'll do cancel for a minute. And you can drag the tool palette just around the screen. If you click on it, it just moves around like that. And if you wanted to just draw on the, the screen, you could, now you could um, choose a color. If you click on the blue, you can choose a, another color if you want, or you can double click and get more colors. Um, oops, let's go back to the pen there. Okay, so we'll go to red. Okay, and then now if you start drawing, it will draw whatever you want on the board. Okay. And if you wanted to save that, if you click the mouse again, it will ask you if you want to save and you can say yes. Okay, and now it's opening a piece of software called Scrapbook, which is our our, so our software, and you can see there's just what you drew, okay? So the other thing about the scrapbook area, I'm just going to move things a little closer to you. Okay, so you've got some menus now, down a little lower. Um, if you want to make a new page, you can make a new page there. And this space here, it allows you to bring any kind of notes that you've done in other programs or whatever else, kind of bring them into this space. There's something called a meeting, so if you click right there, and we can actually, let's have you type your name in the spot there. No, no, no. Okay. And you're Jennifer, right? Oh, yeah, we do. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to say share. And what we can do now is anybody else that's on the internet, they can work in the same space that we're working in. So if we went over there to my friend Robin and we, we let her know that we now had a meeting set up. She could she could click the join button, which is here, and she could work in the same space as us. So in classrooms, it's great because a teacher might write a question on the board, and then all the students can have their own page in the scrapbook, and they can add in information and things like that. Or if you're sick, your teacher could share the meeting from home, and you could sit at home on your computer and stay warm and and learn all the same things while you're sitting at home. So that works that way. Or you could, ha you could have a classroom in England working with a classroom in Spain or you know, Asia somewhere, and they could work together on a project. So, and that's just built into the way the software works. So, okay. yeah.